This video will show you how to mod your new 3DS using the Super Skater Hex method. Let's get started. The Super Skater Hex is only compatible with new 3DS models and firmware 11.17 on the USA, European, Japanese, and Korean consoles. And you need a micro SD card to run it. And you also need a card reader. Let's check some stuff before modding the console. First, let's get into the system settings. As you can see, my console is on firmware 11.17 and has the U suffix. It means this is a US region console. Now close the system settings. And then turn off the console. Now press and hold the select button and press the power button. If the console boot into the standard home screen, it means your console is running the stock firmware and you can follow the rest of the guide. But if you see the Lumet VDS configuration screen, you might only need to do the finalizing step section at the end of the video. Now turn off the console. And remove the micro SD card from it. Download the Super Skater Hex archive from the link in the description. Open the Super Skater Hex archive. Extract all the files and folders to the SD card except the exploit folder. Now get into the exploit folder inside the archive. Select the folder that matches your console's firmware and region. Copy or extract the content to the root of the SD card. Reinsert the SD card into the console. And turn it on. Now activate the camera by pressing the left and the right shoulder button. Press the QR button. There are two available QR codes. Please cover the unused code and point the console toward the QR code that matches your console region. If your console's camera is not working, you need to manually type the URL while you open the console's browser. Press the A button to open the URL. Set the browser search engine if you never opened it before. Click the star icon on the bottom left of the screen. Then click bookmark this page. Press the B button to go back, then click the three lines icon on the bottom right of the screen. Select Settings, then click Delete Cookies. Press the B button to go back, then press the Home button. And immediately, reopen the browser. Click the GoGo -Go text. And press the A button to continue. You should be able to run the Homebrew Launcher. Click the NIM DSP hex. And you will get into the Save B9S installer screen. Enter these combo keys to install the hex.
and press the A button to continue. Press the Start button on the Lumet 3DS configuration screen to boot to the home screen. Press and hold the L, the pad down, and the Select button to open the Rosalina menu. Select Miscellaneous Options. Choose Dump DSP Firmware. Press the B button to go back. Select Nullify User Time Offset. Press the B button twice to go back to the main menu. And select Power Off. Now press and hold the Start button and press the Power button. You will get into the God Mode 9. If you are prompted to backup the essential files and fix the RTC date and time, please do so. Press the Home button and choose Scripts. Select the finalized script. Press the A button to continue. Press the A button again and enter the combo keys to proceed. And press the A button to turn off the console. And turn on the console. Get into the system settings. Select Data Management. Choose Nintendo 3DS. Select Software. And reset it. And then close the system settings. Now turn off the console. Now reopen the God Mode 9 by pressing and holding the Start button and the Power button. Press the Home button, choose Scripts, and rerun the finalized script. Press the A button twice, then enter the combo keys to continue. Now press the A button to turn off the console. Remove the SD card from the console. Create a new folder on your computer and name it anything. Open the newly created folder. Now get into the GM9 folder and enter the backup folder. Select all the files and copy or move it to your computer. Reinsert the SD card into the console and turn it on. And finally, unwrap all the newly installed titles. And you have completed a guide to mod your new 3DS using the Super Scatter Hacks method. I hope you like it, and see you on another video. Thanks for watching.